Hey everyone, welcome back to another For Honor Tips and Tricks video. This time I'll be showcasing tips on Hito Kiri. Whilst quite a slow and immobile character, he packs quite a punch, and is hard to shut down once he is in his chains and mix-ups. For the first tip with tracking heavies, Hitakiri is one of the few characters with variably timed heavy attacks. This is quite powerful for your chain mix-ups, as attacking with different timed heavy attacks are quite difficult to parry. Also, if your opponent tries to early dodge your heavy attacks in order to light interrupt you from fainting to guard break or beat your kick mix-up, charging your heavy slightly longer can catch these early dodges and track your opponent anyway. This will either cause a block stun or hit and prevent the interrupt. For the next tip with kick and sweep beating, the faint window for Hitakiri's bash is extremely generous, to the point where your kick and sweep startups can be fainted. This will more than likely cause a dodge reaction from your opponent, allowing you to faint and guard break their dodge attempt. To do this trick, you need to let the bash be released, but then hit the faint button shortly afterwards, which will cause the bash to start, but still end up being fainted. For the final tip with sweep execute, most of you probably know that the heavy follow up that hits a downed opponent after a sweep does not execute, since it hits your opponent's wake up armor. However, it is possible to execute your opponent off this sweep attack. This can allow you to force an increased respawn time for your opponent, regain your health, and prevent a revive against that opponent. To do this, you need to delay your follow-up heavy input to the latest it can possibly be before being reset back to neutral guard, then charge your heavy just before full, then release the heavy attack. This will still hit their wake-up armor, but still allow for the execute on a lethal hit. It is advised to give this trick a bit of practice before using it in games. This trick is quite difficult to pull off, but can become consistent if practiced. And that's all I have for you today. Special thanks to itzcc547 for helping me record this video. Be sure to check out the other tips videos and future ones to come. I hope you all learnt something new, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good one.